Dang, that looks pretty good. This is really coming out nicely. Welcome back to the channel. I'm the Handy Monk. Today we're doing some automotive maintenance and what we're going to be doing today is we're going to, I'm going to show you how to clean up some headlights. So you can see the headlights on this 2001 Ford Taurus are kind of yellowing. That's because over time dirt and dust will build up on them. They oxidize a little bit on the outside because of the sun and so you get this film. When you're driving at night it's really hard to see because it's obscuring the light as it comes out of the lens. So we're going to try to clean these up a little bit get them looking almost like new and get off this really dirty film that's obscuring our light and impairing our ability to drive at night. So let's get into it. So what I'm going to try here is here I have my really dirty light. I've got some 600 grit sandpaper so I'm going to try hitting it with 600 grit and then if I need a finer finish hit it with a thousand. I'm going to wet sand it so I've got my bucket of water here. I'm just going to go through. First just kind of wet it down a little bit. Get some water on here and this will just help remove this oxidation layer that is here on the lens. So I'm just going to wet sand this a little bit. And you can see, actually, yeah, immediately as I start sanding it, the water gets a little bit dirty. And so there's obviously some junk on this lens. So I'm just going to sand it down here, clean this off. All right, so this is just a couple minutes of wet sanding here, and you can already see this is looking 100% better. It's coming out clear. I can see, you know, inside the lens now, which I couldn't before. There's still a little bit of fogginess on this lens, and so I might hit it with a thousand grit, but you can see, come close. This is looking when I, especially when I get a little bit wet, this is just looking a whole lot better. Again, it's a little bit smoky and foggy. I think that's because I'm using this sort of rougher sandpaper, so I'm gonna go over with some thousand grit, really try to clean it up, but this is working a whole, whole lot better than I expected. So I have the light sanded down here. I've hit it with a thousand and it's definitely looking a lot better, but there's still a little bit of fogginess to the light. And so I have some plastic X. This is just some standard headlight cleaner and a nice applicator pad. I'm gonna try to put some of this on here to see if it'll just kind of clean up and buff out this last little bit of fogginess that's left on this light here. Uh, and it says to apply it and then wipe off with a clean microfiber cloth. Whoops, which I'm sitting on now. Clean cloth up there. So let's try that. Dang, that looks pretty good. This is really coming out nicely. I did come back and hit it with uh, 2,000 grit sandpaper because there were some scratches in there still, which I wanted to kind of smooth out. But dang, that looks really good, especially for a 19-year-old light. Like, it's not yellowy, it's clear, I can see the bulb. Like, that is 100 times better than it was before. Again, I think the sandpaper did do a lot of the heavy lifting, but this Plastic X really help to get rid of that final fogginess and give it a pretty clear shine. I'm not going to say it's brand new, but it's pretty close. That's after. That's just more for my record. Yo, that's gross. That's before cleaning. That's crazy. So there we have it, guys. We've got these headlights really nice and clean, we sanded them down, and then finished them up with Plastic X to get them looking really nice. They look a whole lot better than they did before, and I'm sure it'll be a lot easier to see at night. We get a lot more light out of these. So if you like this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Remember to subscribe, and that's all for now. Go out and kindle and enlighten.